Hi guys, welcome to Sons of Cain. In this video and other videos, we're going to go into the audio descriptive of the Cain. First video, we are going to go back to basics and we're going to talk about the Cain and parts of the Cain. Click subscribe for new videos Wednesdays and Saturdays. So what we have is our walking cane. And we talk about this having four main parts. So if you run your hand along the cane and you get to the far end of the cane whip, you come to the rubber ferrule at the end. This is called the tip. We call this the tip of the cane. So this is the piece that goes on the floor while you're walking or while you're poking or jabbing somebody. If you run your hand up and along the cane until you hit the curve of the crook, that's the shaft. So we'll talk about bottom of the shaft, which will be near the tip end, mid shaft, and top shaft, which gets before the curve. When you get to the curve, if you run your hand along there, the curve is called the crook, and these come in various widths and dimensions. The very end of the crook, we have the horn. And again, we have safety horns which are rounded. This one's what we call a bird head horn. If I use this one, this has a chisel horn. So when we talk about the parts of the cane, we'll say either from the crook, the horn, the shaft, or the tip. Get a cane, familiarize yourself with the parts, running your hands over, feeling where each part goes. So by holding your cane, if you have your hand on the crook with thumb up and the shaft above your thumb so it's like extending a long finger outwards your little fingers at the bottom and that will be going towards the horn this is what we call a walking position so when the cane's on the floor your hand will be on top of the cane your fingers pointing downwards your thumb is pointing away from your body and your little finger is pointing towards your body. When we talk about holding the cane for striking, we are just literally sliding our hand in the same position, thumb up, little finger down, to go down slightly past the, the, the crook to the top of the shaft. With this and the cane pointing outwards away from you, your thumb's near the top, your fingers are underneath the cane, on the shaft and your little finger is at the back end closest to the crook. This is our basic stance for when we strike. When placing your hand on the cane for the first time, ensure that the horn is facing you and the shaft is facing away. Place your hand palm down with the thumb to the left, the little finger to the right, place your palm down and then just curl your hand around it. Thanks for watching this guys. As I say, this is the very first video in a series that we'll be doing for Audio Descriptive. Please like and subscribe and don't forget to ring the bell. Any comments, please put them below. Get in touch with us, let us know what you want to see. We're just going through the basics at the moment, but if you've got something particular you want to know, please drop us a line. Don't forget, free the fear.